First photos from a London hospital show a former Russian spy who was poisoned looking weak and bald. Once a KGB agent, Alexander Litvinenko has lost all of his hair and is now being transferred to an intensive care unit after his condition deteriorated. Linfinenko, an outspoken Kremlin critic, was apparently given thallium. That's a toxic metal which is commonly used to kill rats. He remains in a serious condition. Last night, due to a slight deterioration in his condition, he was transferred to the intensive care unit at the hospital as a precautionary measure. He is not in a position to speak to the media, and he and his family have requested privacy at what is a very difficult, uh, difficult time for them. Kremlin critics say poisoning is a common Soviet-era practice that seems to have reappeared since ex-KGB officer Vladimir Putin became president of Russia. But a Kremlin spokesman says allegations that the Russian government was involved in Litvinenko's poisoning are sheer nonsense. The former spy claims he had been ordered to kill Boris Brezovsky, seen here in the dark suit, an act he did not commit. He also said this Moscow apartment bombing in 1999 was staged by the Secret Services. Litvinenko defected to Britain in 2000 and had recently been looking into the murder of a Russian journalist. He told reporters he fell ill November 1st after eating in a sushi restaurant with a man who claimed to have information about that murder. A friend who helped him defect says Litvinenko may have been poisoned earlier in the day when he met two contacts for a drink. His speech is a little bit distorted, but he can speak without pain and he has been interviewed by the uh, police continuously. I've just seen the detectives again and I had to wait for about half an hour to get into him and then after 10 minutes they kicked me out and said we'll have to continue his interview. Lindvenenko is under armed guard at the hospital. Tim McGuire, the Associated Press.